All right, y'all, it's a 2010 Ford Ranger, previously installed four pile six inch power horns, 50 watts RMS a piece at eight ohms. All you do is remove these four bolts on your Ford Ranger grill. The grill comes back, has two little clips down there. I wire these in parallel, so two positives together, two negatives together, ran to one channel of the amp. Same for this side. Two positives together, two negatives together, ran to one channel on the amp. That'll knock both of them down to four ohms, so push about 53 watts at four ohms per power horn. All right. 35, 10, 50, 15 boggers, 15 by 12 billet specialties, racing lugs, billet specialty center caps, billet specialties, valve stems. Boggers still fairly new. I need to polish them up, but. All right, wires are ran through the firewall. They come down here, through here, out the back, around my back wall, and they all come out right here. This is a Boss 300.2, 600 watts peak. Like I said, I'm pushing about 53 watts at four ohms per horn. That's per channel. Ground, remote, power, it's real simple. RCAs. All right, got the hertz all the way up because the higher hertz. I got the high pass all the way up. So high pass, no low pass. Low pass is for bass. Full range if you want bass and vocals at the same time. Then I have my input level. So that's all the way up. So I got about halfway because I don't want to push more power than I need to of these. All right, let me show you this is test. Oh, by the way, I got a three inch body lift and a four inch spindle. This is spindle, everything else stock. Brand new front end. Like I said, bogs are fairly new. I think I got about 2,000 miles on them. So let me do this distance test. That nigga DJ Miles got the coldest shit. About halfway. Slice. Hey, get out your motherfucker. Slice, 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 slice. Slice, 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 sl